Adam Maskelin chased back deep in his own zone as the Spirit had four skaters out there. Now they're okay. Oh, at one point they had six in the game. Maskerin, oh, what a move! Maskerin scores! Oh, 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 wow! What a play by Adam Maskerin! And the Rangers escape for the 6-5 victory. Oh, my goodness, the last 30 seconds or so seemed very lethargic out there where things were really moving and seemed very slow. And then before you know it, Maskerin just found the room. He took it, he skated, he made a beautiful move and got the Rangers the two points. Let's take a look at this, Gary. So again, it seemed like nothing was happening. The focus was on Jeremy Brocko at the blue line. Maskerin realizes he had all the time in the world and he took it. And look at this, boy. Oh man, right through the legs and then just outweighs the goaltender, Benello. And what a timely goal. And standing by with the game's number one star. I'll guarantee he's gonna get around me pretty quick, just as easily as he got around that last defender. Adam Maskerin joins me now, and I was just asking you off camera, have you ever pulled off a move like that uh, and an OT winner to boot? Yeah, I think it's been a while, to be honest. Uh, I think I, I used to do stuff like that growing up, but you get to this league and guys are so fast and strong, so you try not to do that too much, but you know, I thought I'd be creative, why not? Is it one of those situ situations where you got on the ice thinking, I'm gonna try and pull this move off, or just a split second decision? I, I came up wanting to drop it to Jeremy because, you know, he's been pretty fantastic with the puck, too. And then I saw the D stepped up, and I was like, nah, split-second decision. Why not go for it? All right, we're going to take a closer look uh, at it just because it deserves that a secondary look as we see it on the TV screen right here. Walk us through it. I, I came up. I beat the first guy. Uh, I know they changed, so I faked the drop, and I put it through his legs. And, and I, I know the goalie. He, he knows I'm a shooter, so I thought, why not deke? And then I, I got him. So three-point night again for yourself. Uh, it just seems uh, things to be seems to be clicking for you. Uh, nine points or nine straight games with points. Ah, you know I think it could happen to anyone. To be honest, we got you know four lines going today. Our, our so-called fourth line had I think three points tonight or something like that. So you know everyone's going, and I'm just getting lucky. I'm I'm, I'm putting them in. Congratulations again tonight. Good luck in Sarnia. Yeah, thank you. That's Adam Maskerin. Three points here tonight, including the game winner in overtime for the Kitchener Rangers to win at six-five over the Saginaw Spirit. For producer Steve Gibson, Gary Doyle, Ryan Kovarik, I'm Dan Paulshuk. Thanks so much for tuning in, and we'll see you next time on Kitchener, Rangers Forbes, Rangers Hockey on Rogers TV.